Meanwhile, the All Progressive Congress APC chapter in River State has uh, refuted and disputed claims that its state chairman, the maker Beke, was suspended by faction of the party in the state. This came just hours after Beke uh, Iyayu Chuku Asbuike, the state legal advisor, and Darlington Uwauju, the state's uh, publicity secretary, were all suspended by the party's state executive council on Wednesday. The party's state executive committee, led by Chike Iyinda, announced uh, their suspension at a uh, media briefing in Port Harcourt, blaming them for the party's poor uh, performance in the 2023 elections in the state. These leaders, which include the party state chairman, Chief Emeka Beke, and the legal advisor, Mr. Yanacho Iyanjuku, as it became, under the overall leaders of Right Honorable Rotimi Chibika Meji, have since 2021 held this party on her knees in River State and have been responsible for the mass exodus of the members of the party into another party, as well as the failure experience by the party in the just concluded general election in River State. With the members of the State Executive Committee, therefore resolved as follows. One, that Chief Demeka Beke, the Chairman of All Progressive Congress in River State, is hereby suspended indefinitely for anti-party activities, gross misconduct, and financial mismanagement. However, BK and 16 other members of the executive committee refuted the claims in the press briefing of the party state secretariat in Port Harcourt. If you understand what is happening to the party, distraction, that's what they want to do, nothing more. If you watch in the last couple of the PDP has been there in the front of INEC, they said they will be there till Friday. That's the last day we're going to file our case in the, the tribunal. But it's going to be shocking to them that we're going to file our case in the tribunal. The allegation against our leader, the former transportation minister and former governor of River State, the right, the Honorable Chibike Rotimi Amechi, is preposterous to say the least. Because uh, prior to the general elections, there was no event, there was no meeting, there was nothing of sorts where our leader directed any member of the either the State Working Committee or the State Executive Committee of the APC to vote against our party, the APC. The State Working Committee of the party does not even have powers to suspend any member of the party. The State Working Committee under Article 21 of the 2022 Constitution of the Party as amended only enshrines, only gives room for the State Working Committee to recommend. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.